Another year of the SUNYAC Men's and Women's Swimming and Diving Championships is in the books. SUNYAC Championships is a big meet. It's like our last competition for the season, so everyone tapers and swims super fast and hopefully goes best times. That's the goal. Geneseo senior Nancy Nesky and her teammates reached that goal numerous times throughout the championships, which resulted with both the men's and women's teams coming away with the SUNYAC title. The entire season's building towards this moment, and SUNYAC is a celebration of all the hard work that you do during the season, all the team bonding you do, and all the hard work kind of builds up to this. For all the teams here in Buffalo, the four-day-long event is a culmination of the effort they've been putting in all season long. It's a huge deal. It's the end of the season. Everyone's excited for the end of the season. We are working all year long to this point. It's very competitive, very fun. The atmosphere is amazing. It's the top. It's the big stage. It's where you want to be. These student athletes, whether swimmers or divers, have been spending countless hours training to be the very best they can be. I'd say 18 hours a week at least. There's a lot of working on trampoline stuff and um, lifting and um, a lot of core strength, working on that pretty much to uh, get yourself prepared for something like this. Every team is here with the hopes of winning, and to get energized, you'll find no shortage of some interesting and quite loud rituals before the teams head for the pool. One noteworthy one in particular takes place below this balcony, where Cortland teammates come together. <laughs> Portland senior swimmer Adam Kirschgesner says what the words mean or the origins of this warm-up ritual are anybody's guess. No, I don't know. <laughs> it's a it's been passed down from Portland for, for ages probably, but it's uh no one's really sure what it means. But regardless of what it all means, what matters is it gets this team fired up to go against their competition. It does the job. You, get, you could go from being so tired of doing that and then you're good to go. Hypes us all up, gets us all excited about this one. The loudness doesn't stop there. Whether from fans in the stands above or teammates on the sides of the pool, there's plenty of cheering coming from all directions. I said to my coach earlier, I get the same amount of hype from my race as I do from watching someone else's. And just cheering on the sidelines, it's, you get loud, you're proud, you're going crazy, it's so much fun. SUNYAC swimmers and divers say all the energy in each event shows just how tight-knit these teams really are. The diving community, even all of SUNYAC, we're all a tight-knit community. We all get along, we all support each other in meets, we all support each other through everything. I couldn't do without them. It's all about the teammates, the camaraderie we're with. Um, it's just all about the atmosphere that we create with each other, for each other, and that propels us to do well at the end of the season. More than a sport, more than a team, these student athletes say it's all about supporting each other. We're all support each other and we're close teammates and best friends. It just makes you want to do everything you can to stay where you are and be part of such a great thing camaraderie and support that will continue to propel these SUNYAC teams to success each and every season.